Hi, my name is Vinay p a t i p a t h o p I'm training staff. I would like to talk about the adverse weather. It is coming. It might be the thunderstorms, gusts, and lightning also. These events may cause accidents and harm you and the aircraft while performing your task. s u w a n a p u m Airport seriously considers the circumstance that might occur. Therefore, we have determined the adverse weather notification procedure to inform everyone who is working in the air side. We will inform you through five channels as follows: notify directly via trunk radio to airport staff, notify directly via phone to the office of operator, send an SMS to the station managers, announcing through amplifier. By follow me vehicle, and in the event of adverse weather condition level three, we will turn on the flashing red light and siren to completely notify you all the aspects of weather features. We have split the notification of adverse weather conditions into three level. Level one, when thunderstorms are detected. Within 50 kilometers, and their directions are heading towards Suwanapum Airport. There is notification flowchart of thunderstorms warning as following. We will start notifying everyone by using the phrase "thunderstorms warning." When thunderstorms and or strong wind with speed more than 25 knots are detected within 16 kilometers and their directions are towards or over s u w a n a p u m Airport, it now enters the warning level two. There is notification flowcharts of thunderstorms and strong wind warning as following. We will start notifying everyone by using the phrase "thunderstorms" and "strong wind warning." Oh, it's quite dangerous! If the weather is so dangerous like this, we would have to temporarily stop our operations now. When there is a tendency to have lightning, we are now going to warning level three. There is notification flowcharts of lightning warning as following. We will start notifying everyone by using the phrase "lightning warning" and turn on the flashing red lights and siren. While you're working in the air side, do not forget to observe this light. When you have already received the notification through these various channels, to ensure safety, let's perform your duty in compliance with the instructions as follows. Upon receiving notification level one, to let everyone prepare for adverse weather conditions and operating with carefulness, please do not forget to notify your colleagues about this situation and be alert of aircrafts and vehicle safety, and restore or secure all ground support equipment. When you receive notification level two, please operate with extra carefulness and look for something that would cause an accident. Look, that stairs should be removed from the aircrafts and put the gentry securely on the ground. This will help prevent accidents caused by strong winds. For the aircraft, let's apply parking brake and bond the aircraft ground receptacle. For the light aircraft. It would be parked and tied down into wind upon receiving notification level three. Lightning warning: the flashing red lights and siren will be turned on. Let everyone temporarily stop operations and take cover from the lightning immediately. You can stay in the nearby building, vehicle, lightning shelters, high maze, and under aircrafts with ground receptacle bond. Do not lie down on the floor. Let's sit with knees up and feet together. Avoid contacting or staying near the aircrafts without ground receptacle connected. Refrain from refueling the aircrafts, and do not forget to inform the temporarily suspending operations to pilots. 
For arrival aircraft, let the lights and mechanic monitor the aircraft movement or give it a marshalling signal to the parking position. And then, coordinate with the pilots to apply parking brake and bond the aircraft ground receptacle and wait until cancellation is notified for departure aircraft if the engines are started. Continue the operation until the aircraft can taxi by itself. However, if the aircraft engine is not started yet, the aircraft should consider bringing the aircraft back to its parking bay. Please inform AOCC as well. To emphasize again, if you receive notification of flying warning or see the flashing red light signal and hear the siren on the aircraft stands, it means that you all have to stop your operations temporarily till the weather resumes to normal conditions. And we will notify cancellation through five channels also. All of this is for your safety. I am Vinay Patipat Shop. Goodbye.